Oregon only has 200 golf courses to look at. It has some of the best golf courses throughout the world is in this state. And that's why we had to take a look at the top 10 public golf courses in the state of Oregon. Before you do, take a look at our channel. We're hitting all the public golf courses in each state and the top 10 golf courses in every country. And you ain't going to miss that. So let's zoom in now to number 10 on this list of top 10 golf courses. Running Y Ranch, R72, that stretches 7,138 yards with a slope of 137 and a rating of 73.3. It was built in 1997 and has wintergry, grass, and bent green fairways. And it's an Arnold Palmer course. Let's zoom now into number nine. And we just quickly moved in there. This is a fun golf course here. Pumpkin Ridge Golf. There's a total of two championship golf courses to choose from. And we're going to pick the Ghost Creek course as our number nine course on this list. It's a par 71 that stretches 6,834 yards with a slope of 146, a rating of 74.5. It was built in 1992 as Bengars Greens and Fairways and was designed by golf architect David Johnson. That's now going to move us into number eight on this list of top 10 golf courses you can play. Let's zoom in now. The course is a par 71 that stretches 6,931 yards. It has a slope of 135 and a rating of 74.1. It was built in 1995 by David Johnson. Looks like it had some major updates in 2000. His winter rye grass fairways and is open year round. And that's now going to move us into the better golf courses left in the state. There's still some great golf and we're going to be constantly updating this video periodically. So the next course is a long link style course located in Ben, Oregon. Just taking a quick look at it. There's a lot to be desired here. It's 7,200 in 93 yards with a slope of 141 and a rating of 74.9 it was built in 2008 and it's par 72 the course was designed by david kidd we got a lot of good golf still to take a look at here we haven't even broken into the top five golf courses left and all these golf courses are fairly reasonable. We haven't hit one that's over $100, but golf's constantly changing. That's why we don't put the prices in. Let's zoom in now to a, f a favorite in the area of Portland. This one's very well known. Bar 72 that stretches 6,529 yards with a slope of 124 and a rating of 71. It's got a ton of history, as you can see, with some of these old photos of the old golf course. 1918 it was built and it's just a lot to like there we're getting into some great golf still in the state let's get real so let's take a look now at our next golf course right dab in the middle of the state right there on a the river there's a lot to like about cross water club and it's number five on this list could be higher could be lower course stretches along 7,638 yards with a slope of 150, a rating of 67.9, and it was built in 1995 by David Johnson. Bent grass greens and fairways, its golf season is from April to November. Now we're going to be breaking into the top four golf courses left in the state of Oregon, a state with a mecca of golf courses in one area that we can't or put in all on the list, so we have to break it up into multiple areas. But this one's a fun one, the Retreat Links course here. It's 18 holes of just remarkable golf. The course is actually listed as versable, so you can change it and play it different ways. It was built in 1917, but I guess one way you can play it, it's a par 72 that stretches 7,035 yards with a slope of 130 and a rating of 71.9. It's going to now bring us into the top three golf courses in the state of Oregon. Let's zoom in to number third on this list. 
There's a total of two courses here. We're going to give it to the Nicholas course, which is a par 72 in stretches, 7,460 yards. Built in 2004 by Jack Nicholas and has a rating of 75 and a slope of 148. Now, there's only two more quote unquote golf courses left, but they're really just golf destinations. Let's move now into number two on this list. This is a good one. Heron Lakes Golf Club. And we'll give it to the great blue course there. A few golf courses there to choose from. It's 6,902 yards with a slope of 149 and a rating of 74. It was built in 1992 and was built by Robert Trent Jr. and Sr. It has bent grass greens, winter rye fairways, and is open year-round. Now, you probably know the golf course that we're headed to for our number one spot. That is, we are headed to Brandon, Oregon, pretty much the capital of golf on the west coast you could argue there's so much golf here and we can't give all these golf courses the number one number two number three spots so we had to give them all number one but we're going to give it to the pacific dunes course here it's a link style course that's a par 71 that stretches 6633 yards with a slope of 142 and a rating of 73 it was built in 2001 Hepner. Now that's going to do it for our list. Keep a lookout. We're going to have way more videos coming your way with top golf courses and changing up a little bit. This is World Twilight Golfer. Go, fly. Launch control. This is Houston. We are go for launch.